Hello everybody, welcome to the channel, to Vroom Vroom Zoom. And my name is Andrew and here is my Harley Davidson Roadstar Sportstar. I am in love with this bike, it is absolutely amazing. And one of the things that I wanted to do with this bike is share it with my wife. So it came with, let me show you what it came with. It came with this amazingly comfortable seat out of a 48. Okay, so someone had replaced the original Roadster seat with this genuine 48 seat and it looks awesome on the bike. That's a very comfortable seat. It doesn't, it doesn't kind of look comfy, but it's nice and wide and it is super comfy and a nice style, okay? It's got that little, that, it's got that bobbery style. So because that seat is really quite long, it didn't fit here with the little pillion seat that I bought from AliExpress. Again, it's just a, a nice and cheap little seat. And look, and by little, I do mean little. Have a look at it. <laughs> it's absolutely tiny. Have a look at that seat. Um, it actually is more comfortable than it looks, but it is tiny. Right? It is a very, very tiny seat. Um, especially consider considering how wide the, uh, the rider seat is. Anyway, so there are, so it, that was not going to fit with the 48 seat. So I bought this from eBay as well. And I'm going to put, no, where did I buy it? AliExpress, sorry. AliExpress. And, um, well, have a look at it. It's, it's not bad. It's, it's not a bad seat, okay? Like sitting on it, it actually feels quite nice. But have a look at the workmanship here. You can just, I don't know, and it was cheap. Look, let's be honest. So I just, I just want to show you because I don't want you buying these if, they you know if you're sort of really pedantic about your bike have a look at the like it's just it's yeah it's not not so good and the stitching is mm, it's a single stitched yeah it's sort of double but like it's got the internal stitch there and then the outside stitch but it's still very flimsy sort of stitching and obviously quality control was a bit low because it, it, it's made the fabric like ripple on the side here so yeah not so good but comfortable comfortable definitely is comfortable so there you go um but yeah like i said the uh this did not fit with the 48 and uh this here and, and that is this lovely gap here which i mean i don't really mind but you know that seat with that ripple does not you know does not hardly make Ugh. all right so i just wanted to so, you know, if you're interested, I mean, you might get lucky. Maybe yours is uh, manufactured a bit better than mine, but um, yeah, this one was not. So I will link, 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 link below. So have a look in the description if you do want to buy one. If you're just looking after, a, you know, like a, having a spare around or something like that, it'd be good for that. But um, yeah, apart from that, it's uh, yeah, not so good. Quick little walk around for you. It's current says the bike's a little bit dirty. I do need to clean it. Um, I will point out one more thing about this seat and you can probably see it on a video. Let me see it on your screen. Look at this here. What's that? I don't know, it's a little bump. <laughs> Just a random little bump in the middle of the seat. Hmm, I'm not sure why that's there, but uh, I imagine that's going to poke a hole there soon if I use this seat, which I will probably not be using. But, um, yeah, so just a little manufacturing issue there as well, but you know, can't complain. It was cheap, and by cheap I mean cheap, like cheap, 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 cheap. So there it is. Um, so yeah, if you are after a solution for a pillion passenger, you could do this. But I would say maybe, yeah, there, there are much, much better options for a little bit more money. I was just thinking actually yesterday, what what I see this thing that I'm videotaping on here. It's an iPhone 11, and it's a, what a great phone it is. And I was just thinking, I have never had buyer's remorse buying this camera here that I'm recording on. And the other thing I've never had any buyer's remorse on is buying this thing. <laughs> and that's pretty much pretty much it. There's no no buyer's remorse at all when I bought this bike, which is very rare for me. But it is an amazing bike and um yeah, it's yep. Yeah, I, I'm lost for words. <laughs> it's just it's a it's a great bike. So if you can get your hands on one, awesome. There's not many around in Australia. But, I will just quickly explain that uh, I was trying to fit the pillion pegs down here and that's why that chrome cover is off at the moment and I haven't bothered cleaning it because I'm getting it all dirty everywhere as I'm working on it. So uh, just please disregard the actual appearance of this and, and I know, 
it breaks my heart to look at it like this, but I am in the middle of doing something. I need some tools and I'm waiting for some tools. So when I get them, it'll be all rectified. So please don't hate me showing this bike in this state, but it is what it is. All right, another quick little note before I go. Have a look at this awesome license plate. Yeah, how, how good is that? It sets it off so nicely. <laughs> it's great. Just finally, we'd really appreciate if you subscribed. Little button down here if you're watching it on a computer or, you know, I think there's a button on the left-hand side for phones and stuff. And uh, yeah, I've got lots of videos coming about the Harley. I've got a motor block set up coming as well for my helmet. So I'll, I'll get some more footage of me actually riding this bike and yeah, having some fun, fun, fun. Hello, everyone. Have a good one.